Hi friends, welcome back to Alice Play World. Bring some more Heroes of the Storm. Today we're playing you some Candy King Murden gameplay. And I'm gonna be honest, I didn't like the skin at first, but then somebody told me that when you go Avatar, you turn to chocolate, and I was like, I have to see that. And then I started looking at it, and you had like gumdrop shoulder pads, and I, I don't know what those are. If they're chocolate mints or they're donuts, but either way, I'm down. I'm 100% down. Welcome to the Tomb of the Spider Queen. Enemy Team Illidan, Vala, Sylvanas, Tigus, Nova. Friendly Team Lily, Sylvanas, Illidan, Teriel, and Muradin. We do have another uh, warrior, which is good. It's good news. Oh my god, I look ridiculous. <laughs> look, look at that. It's so, so ridiculous. So much big. I love it. Uh, we're going to go ahead and lane middle, I suppose, and hit somebody with lollipops. It's a good thing that we have Teriel, because he can build a little bit more aggressive. And I'll be building more tanky and supporty. The first time we're going to be picking up is Infuse Hammer. Stormbolt will refund mana if it hits an enemy. Uh, this double tank lane is a little ridiculous, but I like it. Uh, our Q ability is called Stormbolt. It throws a mighty hammer that stuns people. Uh, the first target hits, so it doesn't penetrate minions. you got to be careful with the aiming. Our W ability is called Thunderclap. It does damage around our area and slows enemies by 25% for 2.5 seconds. Yes, it is. And, of course, our E ability, Dwarf Toss, allows us to jump and, uh, to an area, get over obstacles and whatnot. Our trait is called Second Wind. Basically, we get a little bit of heals uh, if we are to combat for, I believe, 4 seconds. This cannot be the real Nova. There's no way that's the real Nova right now. There's no way. Okay. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and try to scare them off here. This is the real Vala though. We're gonna go ahead and stun her and walk away. Oh, I was waiting for Aelin to go there. I'm gonna try to go deep on her. Oh, unable to land there. Now we're trying to jump on the enemy Aelin. This is a really messy setup here. Uh, it's a really messy setup. We're gonna go ahead and get the stun out. Oh, we're getting chased really deep there by Sylvanas. He's gonna do quite a little bit of damage. We do make it out of there alive. And now we're forced back. Our healing is gonna kick in, so we don't even need to go to the healing well, but we are gonna though, however. We are gonna. Good jump in there on the freight hero. Doing quite a little bit of damage. That's the real Nova. That's the real Nova, so she should be able to get a kill here. Oh, that's devastating. I messed that up completely. So I'm forced back here. Uh, I could have gotten a kill there on Tigus. I don't know why I got like I panicked. I was like, oh, there's too many targets. And then didn't land any of them. All right, I'm going to return to the middle lane now that all that nonsense is done. Uh, we ended up being behind by one kill. That was what happened there. Uh, and try to release a little bit of XP here. Uh, if you don't know what the Team of the Spider Queen is, which, by the way, you should, because I don't really explain the maps anymore. If you do, go see my first videos. <laughs> Uh, basically, you kill these metallic spider fellas, and then you uh, you get little gems from them, and then you hand them in, and that's 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 what's good. That's what's good. That's what you're doing. It does look Savannah's agreeing that that was dumb. Uh, I think it was silly, but you know what? It's a team brawler. So you want to have a little bit of fight here. We're leeching a little bit of XP. Uh, it looks Savannah's is the main thing she's not getting right now is gems. I think um, by not engaging here, which is fine. I'm gonna go ahead and run around, just grab those gems, let those things die. Uh, not a big deal here. That's why I'm a little bit overexposed. It looks like the friendly team wants to go here for an engagement. I, I, I don't know why I got dismounted. We're going to go ahead and get here on Tychus. Big slam. We're going to slow him down. Here comes here with the body blocks. Can we jump in front of him? We do jump the wrong way, sadly. And we're jumping on Vala. Trying to do a little bit of damage. Here comes Lee to save us up. Uh, we could, oh, we could have done so much. We could have done so much there. We could go ahead and grab those chips here. I'm going to go ahead and jump first. Oh, I was trying to jump. I didn't, couldn't even say the words. Trying to jump and I do drop a giant gem there that nobody picks up. All that effort. 900 zero damage, one death already with three takedowns. What are we doing, Candy King? All right. I need to focus. I need to focus. This is a Friday video. I'm loopy because I have not slept. I did not sleep Thursday night and I worked all day today. So expect a lot of nonsense happening today. The first time we're going to be picking... Oh, sorry. See? Nonsense. The second time we're going to be picking up is third wind. Increasing our second wind's healing by quite a little bit. Uh, especially if we're below 35% health. This basically, if you did not play in the alpha, puts Muradin kind of back to where he used to be. He used to be really powerful healing, and they nerfed him a little bit natively. And now they basically added that talent to sort of make up for that. Uh, so far, so good, though. I mean, I, I really like it. I think it's a good spot. It's a good compromise because it forces you to build that tanky. Before, he was a little overpowered. You could build for a little bit more damage on top of doing all that. Just look at Tiro going there really deep. We're going to go ahead and... Uh, never mind now. I mean, if you want. You want to kill, kill this girl? You want to kill this girl? Why am I stunned there? I don't... I was trying to pick up a kill there. I don't know what the hell happened to my controller. I was trying to land a hit. It does look Nova finally jumping in here. We do get taken down, though. That's a sad day for us. And she does grab a bunch of coins. Uh... I do know why my tune did uh tune stood still. All right, let's go back in here. Uh, again, remember if you see and you are wondering why does Al type so slowly is because I have a giant microphone in my face and my keyboard is tilted to the left. So if I try to type normally, I basically type nonsense. So I got to peek around and see what I'm doing. It's not the greatest thing ever, but you know. 
but we're really getting caught a little bit of position there. She's gonna be fine, I think. We're gonna go ahead and stun. Never mind. We can basically some people out trying to make sure she didn't die. Good jump there. Gonna try to jump in front of her. We do slow her down. That pick up a kill. Now jumping on Tychus. Uh, he's gonna be really got our position. If we have anybody to come with us, we're gonna be able to land a stun there. We do not. And now we're Illidan is jumping on us. Let's go ahead and slow him down. Maybe trade with him. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and jump away. I also do not want to have any part of that. We're gonna go ahead and pick up the drinking healing well. Next time we're picking up a level 7 is Stormbolt can now hit two targets. That's actually really powerful. It allows us to have a little bit of penetrate uh, through minions as well as with good positioning. And initiate fights really well. So let's go ahead and start cleaning these guys out. Uh, we're finally getting gems again. Uh, we've been doing a horrible job of doing that. because We did have a lot of gems earlier on. And we did drop them for absolutely no reason. Basically just dying because I was trying to cast a Stormbolt and my character stood there like, what, what, but I don't get it. This is like Illy going really deep here. I'm going to try to save Sylvanas. Uh, she's getting caught up position though. She's getting caught up position. Here comes the stun on Illidan! We do land it, and I'm gonna go and jump on the other side and basically just Stormbolt just in case. Thunderclap, I mean. Um, and we do pick up a kill at least. That's that's kind of neat. And now let's go ahead and hand these in. That's uh, we're gonna need. We're gonna be one shy of actually turning these in. So if Illidan comes down here, that's gonna be fine. Uh, big engagement going on here. We're gonna go ahead and jump on Vala. It doesn't look like we're gonna slow her down. Here comes another stun, and we do miss her. And we're gonna be able to pick up a jump there on Nova. Can she can we get her? It looks, it looks like she did get away. It looks like she did manage to get away. We need one hand in here. Anybody will do. We'll get our first uh, spider hangout of the day. That's what I call them. A bunch of web weavers come in and, and hang out with us. I'm gonna go engage on Tychus. I don't like this at all that he's going here. Oh, he just move out of the way there at the last second. I'm gonna go ahead and slow him down. Trying to move him back. He do force the move back. That's good. And let me just clear the lane. Grab a little bit of XP while we're here. Big engagement in the middle lane. It looks like our family team just pushing this uh, tower. That's fine. We're going to sit here and take a little bit of damage here. Trying to basically split up so our spider guys uh, stay alive. So that when uh, these guys come, they're going to have a little bit of backup. Only three spiders are actually going to walk themselves into the wall. Not a big deal. Let me go ahead and push middle lane. Seems to be the wise thing to do. Big push in the middle from all involved. Should be good. We're going to go ahead and engage there on Tychus. Jumping really deep, slowing them down. Trying to get a kill here. It doesn't look like we scare them off. However, we're basically zoning for our friendly spider thing to do a lot of damage. And so far, that's exactly what we're doing. I'm going to go ahead and auto-attack this wall while she's sort of killing the healing well. Not a big deal. Not a big deal. And Thunderclap going out. It does look like we're forced to sort of retreat here a little bit. Um, I'm going to go ahead and get a stun there. You do land it on Nova. And now I'm forced all the way back. All the way back. Let's go ahead and dwarf toss out of there so we don't get killed. Maybe even hit up the healing while we're a little low in mana before we re-engage. The next town level 10 avatar. Now we can turn into giant chocolate man. Does look like Sylvanas getting caught up position. She's getting she's really deep. Can we pick up the kill there on Nova? Can we pick up the kill there on Nova? Hello, Nova. Hello, Nova. That's the real Nova, everybody. I'm gonna go ahead and pop Avatar. I am made of chocolate, and I'm here to kill her. However, I don't have any friends. What happened? What happened, friendship? What happened, friendship? All right, we'll go ahead and get your Antikas. Just look, we're gonna basically be able to body block him. Trying to pick up some kills here. It does not look like the friendly team is opting to go for me. We do get a stun there on the enemy Nova. And here comes the Thunder Cup. Really good pickup. We're gonna dive really deep for this Illidan. We're gonna dive so deep for Illidan. I don't even care. I don't even care. I'm gonna auto attack for days. Here comes Sylvanas. We're tanking it for her. And now we should just kill this. Now we should just straight up attack this forward and pick up a kill. Because that was worth it. Good ultimate there from Lee. He can get us all topped up. As we do attack this with a vengeance. And push all the way back. However, the enemy team does get its web weavers out. It's a little devastating. But not really. Uh, we could have gone for the boss. That's a good idea. It's a little ballsy, but a good idea. Can we make it? Can we make it? Can we make it? Uh, we can't make it! No, we can't. I tried to make it, but I couldn't. I did jump for the finish. Now we're going to have to go in a little bit of defensive mode. I don't have any mana. 24 seconds. So we're going to try to come to the bottom lane. Actually, I want to go middle, but I don't think anybody's going bottom. So I'll do it. I'll defend bottom. Although Savannah's going down there. That's a smart idea. All right. I'm going to try to engage here. Stunning Nova. Doing Thunderclap. Doing a little bit of damage. And then jumping in front of her for the kill. Not a big deal. Now we're going to be forced back to defend. Uh, I guess she decided not to go bottom. Or nobody has to go top. We should really be defending this, you guys. You guys, come on. Let's jump in here. Make sure we stun the spider lady. We don't. Slow her down. Make sure we are standing behind her when she does that. As I just do quite a little bit of damage. As you can see, this does break our gauge. It's kind of rude. Let me make sure we grab the gem. Kill that slider. Grab another gem. And then just clear out the rest of these minions uh, before we move on. So that is also going to give us quite a few gems to hand in. It looks like Lily dying on the bottom lane. So is in a lot of trouble. This big push is actually kind of messy. I'm going to try to make my way over there to help out. 
A little bit late though, a little bit late for the party. Good engagement there from Illidan is going to start chasing them. I might actually be a little late for the party, but an opportune. So I'm going to be able to land this stun on nobody. I'm going to jump away. Oh, I'm going to jump away. Let's go ahead and drink from the healing well. Illidan going so deep, he just managed to uh, <laughs> die. I'm going to grab a couple of these gems and then move away. Move away. Go ahead and uh, Avatar here just to get a little bit of health. Uh, it just looks like Sylvanas gets out. I wanted to go ahead and land a stun. We do land it on Nova. And now we're sort of backing away. We have uh, healing kicking in right now. Next time we need picking up, it's Thunderclap heals us. It's going to be a little bit tanky. It's actually not what I wanted. If I'm going to be completely honest with you, it's not what I wanted. We're going to get out of here. Uh, basically watching the enemy team completely destroy us while Tyrael sort of hangs out. I wanted to come back. A good judgment would be a good way to engage. It does look like the enemy team finally backing up, though. Uh, let's make sure we clear that out. We have enough coins, though, to where this should be the thing to do. Uh, maybe a gank push happening here? Is that what is that the deal is? Nope. Uh, okay, we have a lot of coins, so we're going to hand them in together, I feel. I hope. Jumping in the middle of this. I've been throwing a Thunderbolt for fun, although that's a lot of mana that I shouldn't have used up. Uh, what talent could have I got? Yeah, I wanted Burning Rage. That's exactly what I wanted that I didn't grab. You guys, plan your talents better than I do uh, if you play this game. Please. If you, play, if you play this game, play your talents. Let's go ahead and, and say we're going to go hand in here. Between, uh, actually, yeah, I'm going to go basically hand in two. That's fine. That is fine. Let's go ahead and uh, wait for a push here. We, uh, I'm actually going to go grab those mercs down there in the bottom lane. Because uh, it'll be worthwhile to have these. At the very least, have something going on. We do stun them both. And now we're going to have a little bit of help here from our friendly teammates. However, they do grab the ball from the top lane. That's a good counterplay by the enemy team. Now we're going to be forced to go back there and defend, although I like the idea of pushing instead. I think I think let the boss do whatever it wants and then he's going to get a, going to get a key kill. Never mind. We need to back out. We need to back out. I'm going to go all the way back to the base and go ahead and defend that for, that boss uh, push. Just look at Illidan there already with Sylvanas. They're going to be doing quite a little bit. I'm already healed up. Uh, let's warn Kiro of Danger. That's a really bad spot to be in by yourself right now. They, in fact, they're coming. We do lose a fort, and they already killed all our stuff, so not the greatest moment there. At the very least, this uh, web we were served to sort of like delay the boss as we do do a little bit of damage and try to take him down. We finally kill it. Took one fort down, and it looks like Tyrell did uh, sort of holy war it down. We still have this pushing up, she does die on her own. Never mind. Never mind! We got nothing. Uh, Illidan and Kulsor retreat there, I don't know for what. Oh, really bad positioning. Really bad positioning. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, you guys. Looks like uh, Lily finally rejoining the game. We have a really crazy push going on here. Uh, we do get caught there by the enemy Bala. I'm trying to go deep here. Trying to go deep here. Oh, we do miss that stun. And then we're going to retreat casually. Uh, not much we can do. The enemy team does get another web we were attacked. Uh, we should sort of ping this. I'm going to go ahead and drink from the healing before it goes away. Go ahead and stun Bala. Jumping in. And then doing slow damage, we're going to be able to pick up the kill on her. Jumping on Illidan now, who's going to be a little bit wounded. He does with the metamorphosis. We're going to get hit there a little bit. Trying to save Lili. Can we pick up the kill? We do stun him at the last second. Let's go ahead and jump on the other side of the Odin. And go ahead and pick up the slow on both of those. That's the real Nova. That's the real Nova. Come on, chaser, 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 chaser. Chaser! I do stun. I basically want to kill the Odin, man. I'm going for a chase. Like, I'm chasing so deep, but now we should back out. As I say, we should back out. You see Bala <laughs> going really deep. We do pick up the kill, but now we got to defend. Oh, we got. I'm trying to get in the way of that. I'm trying to get in the way of that. Come on, where you going, girl? Where you going, girl? We're gonna go ahead and slow Sylvanas here. Why is this not clicking, man? Why is this not clicking? I'm gonna make sure to grab all these. Uh, go ahead and jump up, and oh, we do pick up the kill there on Sylvanas. And I'm in a lot of trouble, homie. I'm in a lot of trouble. I want to wait for that shimmering to come back here. Oh, I need to go. I need to go. She's going to do so much damage. Go ahead and stun. Oh, oh, no. Look at all those gems. Look at all those gems. Why, Tyrael? Why did you leave me alone, man? Why did you leave me alone, bro? My feelings. They they hurt deeply. They hurt very deeply. All right, we're going to be picking up Dwarf Lunch. I'm a little devastated. Look at the stats really quickly. 19,000 uh, hero damage for the friendly Sylvanas. 24,000 for the enemy Sylvanas. Overall, they're doing a lot more damage. We have a, slightly, a, a slight edge on kills. Uh, we do have also a slight edge on siege damage, it seems, it seems like. Uh, now, basically, well, I mean, they do have... We're sort of tied. This is a close game. I'm not going to lie. This is, this is a little bit of a close game. I don't feel like we have the edge on gameplay, though. Mostly because uh, we've had Illidan sort of struggling and being on his own for a lot of the game. And I don't even think he grabbed Judgment, did he? Oh, yes. That's 
That's devastating. <laughs> he did not grab judgment, which would have been a huge pickup. Um, now we're in a lot of trouble. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and join in here. Uh, turn into candy. Uh, maybe jump here on Tychus. Uh, can we go on the other side of Tychus? It doesn't look like we body block him. We're catching him out of position. We're gonna go ahead and slow him down. That's gonna be a kill here, no problem. We do pick up the kill there, thankfully. Now, a lot of damage going on. Sylvanas as well. We do pick up the double kill here, too. Uh, I'm waiting for the dwarf. Toss! Here comes the stun! We do stun her, and we do save Illidan at the last second. And now we've gotta walk away. We gotta walk away. I'm trying to do something ha I'm trying to do something somewhere. Just look, we have Illidan right here. Can you, you care to fight with us? No? No? Okay. Fine. Fine! I'll see you later. I didn't even want to fight you anymore. That's gonna be 18 gems out of 60. As you can see, a little bit devastating there. Uh, although, finally, here comes Cyril with a little bit more. And now we're going to go try to deal with these mercenary pushes here in the bottom lane. Really good job on the enemy team, though. Really good job on the enemy team of holding us back. We're going to try to come in here. I am greedy. I'm going to go get the gem. And trying to push this back. I, as you can see, I'm not equipped for this. Candy <laughs> King Murden is not the guy to be doing this. But thankfully, La Vala... Oh, sorry. Sylvanas comes here. Oh, man. That's, that's, that's rude. She uses a crossbow and a bow. I just got confused. All right. Finally coming here, and we're going to be fine. It just looked at the friendly team opting to go for those mercs. The enemy team are likely going to go for a hand-in relatively soon, so we're going to be careful about that. Jumping here, doing W. I don't like this uh, four people take a merc uh, sort of gameplay. I think it's not really rewarding. It, it just You sacrifice a lot of map control and a lot of visibility by having everybody in there. But it's also better than just having somebody die, I think. All right, let's go ahead and engage here. Uh, here comes the stun. We're going to try to slow him down. And then Dwarf drops the oh, way just so we can get out. We can get out. Uh, three seconds here. Two seconds. Can we make it? Avatar comes out! We do pick up the Avatar. And now we're going to trade here with uh, <laughs> Illidan. And we do pick up the kill. He shouldn't have not uh, dived that, but it's fine. Now we're going to go really deep. We're going to go really deep right on Sylvanas. Do pick up the kill there as well. Here comes the stun on Tykes. One more time. Here comes the slow two. Oh, he's taking so much damage. He does pick up that first aid. Now we're chasing with a vengeance. And we do pick up the kill even though he does grenade. That was a really good jump. Uh, I don't know why Illidan's upset about this. That was a really great play by, from everybody in the friendly team. In fact, I'm actually going to reply with a, a question mark. Because I'm genuinely curious as to what that was about. What that was about. Alright, I think we're going to go for the boss. I think this is... Uh, might as well. Yeah, she's starting. So let's go ahead and start. Auto attacking here. While well, Lily should make her way here promptly. Let's go get hit by that. Uh, a little risky with not having more damage though. I feel like Sylvanas is actually not providing enough DPS on her own. Lily should be able to come in here and do a little bit of damage. She looks like she's trying to focus on healing, which is not necessarily the best. Uh, is this the real Nova? That's not the real Nova. This is the real Nova, though. We're going to slow her down and then pick up a stun as well. Try to get on the other side. Body blocking her, and we do pick up a kill, though. That was good. That was good. All right. Back to the boss, it seems like. Finally, material here. Although there looks to be an engagement here. Uh, we should not pull that. I am a second tank, though, so it's actually worthwhile for me to sort of hang out here and wait for the gank push. Here comes the stun on Illidan. Oh, we do miss it. Let's go ahead and jump in here. Slowing them down. Illidan's taking so much damage. Good stun there. However, we are moving out of the way. Illy going really deep. Illy going way too deep, man. Going so deep. Let's go ahead and slow. I need to jump out if I can. It does look like we managed to get out of the way. Uh, well, Wailing Arrow would have killed me. Trying to get in a better position. The next time we're going to be picking up is the upgrade to our avatar. I'm going to try to jump in here. That's a stun. Not a big deal. And now we're going to be forced back. This is a bad engagement at this point. It does look we're going to be easily able to join here. Oh, what's up? That was that was kind of scary. I'm trying to zone them out. It does look like uh, we need them to start this and somebody to stay out here. Uh, it does not look like the team, team wants to do that. Let's go ahead and stun. Here comes the engagement. Go to go ahead and avatar. Do quite a little bit of damage. You're going to just chase Tychus. I think we should just chase Tychus. Good jump. Trying to do as much damage as we can. That's enough. It does look like that's the real Nova. We trying to body block. Trying to body block. That's an awesome skin, by the way. I have like little chocolate things on the top and all kinds of candy. Uh, meanwhile, <laughs> we lose a fort as uh, nobody was paying attention to anything else. Sylvanas does hand in some coins there, though, in the middle lane. Some gems. It does look like that's a bombardment, though. That's good. And we're going to go ahead and go back here. Mana up and re engage. Illy being a very picky. Let's see, he has 22,000 stats. Yeah, you shouldn't be talking a little bit, buddy. You're not really doing that much damage, I'm just saying. Uh, 18 and 9. Yeah. Uh, don't... Uh, glass glass houses, guys. Glass houses. That's going to be my motto of this game. Uh, let's go ahead and try to hook up here with our team on the top lane. Just like Lily, a little bit out of position. A really aggressive position. And she does go on the other side, though. And manages to get out of there. She does juke the enemy. No, I know she's around here. But she is... She was a bot for a second. 
Nova was a bot for a second, which is a good sign. We want her to be a bot, as that's going to allow us to get a kill. Uh, it does look like the friendly, friendly team wants to engage here in the middle lane. We gotta go ahead and go really deep. Here comes the stun. We do miss that on both of those guys. Uh, basically, Savannah's jumping in here. We, I don't see Nova anywhere. She did get away with it. She did get away with it. We need to push somewhere. Oh, that's a good pick up there. Good job, Sylvanas. Here comes a stun on her. We do pick up the stun and the slow. And that's going to be a good game. We do save Sylvanas just in time. And now we're able to basically engage more people here. Really going really deep. However, I'm going to go ahead and stun here. I'm doubling it up here on the Odin. Going really deep. The Odin is my target as the, he is the easiest person to kill. However, good engagement there from Illidan. Uh, go ahead and slow these guys. Let me even stun them again. Try and do a little bit of damage on the Odin. Again, Illidan is so hard to, like, DPS down that I feel like that's why I'm going really deep here. Now switching to Sylvanas. We're going to be able to pick up the slow there and kill her as well. And now this should be a backup. This should be a backup. Um, the one thing that I find hilarious <laughs> is that Illidan is saying, I need help on O. On o. Like, he needs O help. Um, you can't O by yourself, homie. Like, that's... Just, just keeping it real. You cannot or you should not O one your, by yourself. Uh, we should back out of here. This is not a good engagement. We do have gems. We should hand them in. I don't know why our friendly team is continuing to push. But I suppose one in Rome uh, break a tower. Uh, we are basically a little bit out of match here as soon as Noah respawns. So we're going to go ahead and land here. Boom, doing damage. Here comes the stunt on Tyke as we do pick up the kill. That's a good pickup as we're going to be able to trickle down. Uh, now Tribble in a lot of trouble. I don't know why he did that. That uh, ultimate is so terrible. I feel awful. Let's go ahead and back out. Let's go ahead and back out. He's going to mount up. I have 23 uh, gems. I'm going to just go hand those in. Ignoring our friendly team. Like, oh, come on, guys. Come on, guys. Let's just get out. Let's just get out. How many times have I told you? We just need to get out. I don't think it's a good idea either. Oh, my goodness. I'm just going to hand these gems in. I'm, I'm done dying with gems. I want to hand them in. They do have enough damage. Uh, it does look like Ailey picking up camps on this side. That's going to be good. Now that we have the gems in, I'm going to go back and try to help our teammates because if they get caught here, it's going to be a bad time. It's going to be a bad time. All right, let's go ahead and hand those in. Now we need to escort Sylvanas for that gem hand in. That would be important. The enemy team already doing a uh, hand in of their own, and that would be bad. It does look like Lily jumping in here. Does she see anybody? It doesn't look like she does. That's a good setup. It does look like we're going to be able to zone here in between both of these guys. And then make our way to the top lane. It does look like they're going to go for the boss. That's a good pickup, although the enemy team might be already there. Uh, it does look like Nova was around here already. Let's go ahead and jump here on Illidan. Uh, popping uh, Avatar there. Just try to get out. It does look like we're going to jump overhead. It's trying to slow her down. Good healing there from uh, Lily. I can't get out because I'm too big. I get body blocked by Sylvanas. They do pick up the kill there on Vala. Now jumping here on Sylvanas. That goes down as well. However, we do lose our Sylvanas. And now Lily in a lot of trouble. Here comes Serial on the engagement on the fake Nova. And now Lily's going to die. <laughs> Lily is... Uh, she, she does get away, though. Uh, she should not engage anymore. That's, that's fine. Just move on back, girl. Go back. Meanwhile, Illidan in the bottom lane doing God knows what. I'm sorry. I feel like there's a lot of salt in this game. I'm going to apologize for that. I, I normally try not to be uh, that salty. But it's, there's a lot of negativity going on all over the place here. Like, <laughs> I, can't, I can't let it go. I'm not calling out the players, but just this is an example of sometimes what makes this game frustrating is it's a team game and everybody's doing whatever they want. A little bit annoying. However, really strong push here for the mercenaries. Might be able to pick up a keep kill uh, here in the bottom lane as well. Here, the giants do pick up one. Might even kill this tower, which would be a little bit more XP. Really good job. Illidan's going to have a hard time dealing with this. Sorry, Tang's going to be a hard time dealing with this while Illidan is poking him. He does force him back, though. And we are going to be able to pick up the kill here on the tower as well. However, meanwhile, in the top lane, they don't get the boss kill. So that's actually a really big win for the friendly team. Looking at stats really quickly, Sylvanas really, really owning our team as far as damage uh, on all kinds of stuff. As well as XP uh, contributed. Really good job for enemies to the friendly Sylvanas. On their team, uh, really good job Tychus, who's a little bit been a little bit gimped since the last patch. He's doing a really good job of representing for Tychus. And, of course, who else is doing really well? I suppose pretty much Sylvanas and Noah are doing decent. So good job. The enemy team does get a Web Weaver Assault right now. We are two keeps up. I don't know why I got hit by that. I was, I was, I thought I still had the thing open, so I wasn't even paying attention. But I was able to move. We do have the boss engaged here, which is actually really good. Because the enemy team unlikely to think that this is what we're doing right now. Um, although, I mean, we haven't been there for a while. Let's go ahead and get in the middle. And get that up. It does look this. We're going to jump in really deep. Here goes the Avatar. We're trying to jump in here. Trying to split them up. It does look we have a good stun lined up here. We do land it on both members of the enemy team. It comes to slow as well. Jumping on Sylvanas and uh, killing her. Here comes the kill on Nova as well. Now killing on Vala. I'm going to go ahead and Dwarf Toss out of there. Waiting for my Nate healing to kick in. Vala chasing really deeply. 
Uh, I'm gonna be able to basically heal up in a second. Trying to save Sylvanas there. Let's go ahead and stun that way. We do pick up a stun. Here's the slow. We pick up the kill on Vala, and now let's jump away so that Odin does not kill us. That was really good. That was really good. And now the Odin in a lot of trouble. Getting cheesed by everybody. And do we do pick up the killer as well. However, somebody does die on our side. I don't know who it was. Tyrael being kind enough not to explode in our face. That was kind of neat. That was kind of neat. I appreciate that, man. Go ahead and jump here on the spider lady and try to pull her back. However, Illidan picking up the last keep kill there. Never mind. That's the enemy Illidan dealing with their boss. So the boss did a good job of pushing on his own. And Illidan finally team fought with us, which is really good. Thank you, sir. I give a heads up to Max Bauer. I appreciate you finally jumping in here, man. And uh, being a team player, you can see it doesn't make a huge difference when you have five members of the friendly team. It does look like we did lose Lily and Tyrael. Lily could have been saved a little bit better. I feel a little regretful about that. I feel like I dropped the ball a little bit. However, we're going to have an immediate bombardment here. Sylvanas already grabbing the mark in the bottom lane. Smartly, a really good play here by the friendly team. This is going to also have even more pushing power. I'm going to go down there and help her out so she doesn't take unnecessary damage. I don't think I deal that much damage, but every little bit helps us, you know? Every little bit helps. Uh, can you get on this side? Thank you. And then stun them both. Not that I need to stun them, but it does a little bit more damage than my auto attack. And we're going to be able to clear this out no problem. Now we need to group up in a giant death wall and, uh, and basically just push for the win. This should be the one strategy. All five in the middle lane pushing a big, big death wall of awful. And just completely annihilate the enemy team. However, we're waiting here. Um, Sylvanas going back for mana. I think manually she's taking a drink of the healing well. Here is Cyril Illidan uh, already gone. So this isn't actually quite work out the way we wanted it. Uh, we should go up here and push with that thing. Uh, we should all push together in one direction. It does look the enemy Illidan already here. I'm waiting for an engagement. However, where's my friendly team, man? I don't see it. It does look like they went to the bottom lane. I'm going to go ahead and engage on that side. I at least bothered to ping, so uh, if you guys could do me a favor and like either listen or ping me back, that would be really appreciated. Not a big deal though. All right, we're gonna make it here a little bit late, uh, sadly, just a little smidgen late. But that's and you can see that was a bad choice <laughs> because now we lost everyone. We're gonna go ahead and land a good stun there on Vala. Uh, however, not the greatest engagement here by the friendly team. We're gonna go ahead and retreat. Not the greatest stuff. I'm gonna try to make my way around. To help Sylvanas, who's already poking a little bit. Go, oh, a lot of drop frames. Oh man, trying to jump in here and do a little bit of damage. However, a little late. I was trying to save our friend from that triple death. That hungry arrow doing a lot of damage. We we're just gonna run back, and that was a little bit of a waste. That was a little bit of a waste. Um, again, Tyrael complaining a little bit. You shouldn't have engaged there, man. If <laughs> nobody was around you, you just gotta pay a little bit of attention. Uh, let's go ahead and jump in here in the middle to make sure we tank this for the friendly Sylvana so she doesn't have to take damage. She's doing a lot of stunning though, so this should go by relatively quickly. Luckily, the enemy team, however, she does die from Illidan. Oh, that's a good job, friend. He's going to try to run out now. Uh, I didn't want to do that, but just look, Illidan's getting caught up. position. I'm going to try... Uh, never mind. Never mind. I was going to try to heal him, but he does die chasing kills. So now, though, we got to wait 65 gems. It's not a big deal. We do have a two-member disadvantage at the moment. One-member disadvantage at the moment. However, Nova... Is going to be back up in 42 seconds. So we'll have Tyrael for the next team fight, which will be ensuing shortly. They are pushing the middle lane with a little bit of power. And I'm doing it. Basically, I'm just watching. There's not much else I can do. Um, because this push is really mighty. I really need Lily and Tyrael to come here. Sylvanas is waiting for the Wailing Arrow really smartly. We're going to let them basically push back here. Um, Tyrael, man, if he had judgment, this would be so easy. This would be so easy if he had judgment, man. <laughs> I'm just telling you, if you're watching this uh, Lemma, Lemma Magician, please just never pick up that ult that you picked up, man. It's it's so situational. You basically would need uh, a, a, a basically team speak to pull that off. It's, it's it's rather silly, and and judgment's so good. You just judgment on Nova and you know move on with your life. It doesn't look like we're gonna be able to end these in. She's saying wait, Lily. I don't know why we do it. Oh, Illy, sorry. We're waiting for Illidan. That's not a big deal. He does have the hunt, I believe. Does he not? He did pick up the hunt. Yes, which means we can actually engage right now, and that'll be fine, because Illidan will be able to catch up to us anytime. They are probably going for those mercs. However, here's Illidan in the middle lane. Actually, here's Nova in the middle lane as well. Let's go ahead and jump on her. We do catch her out of position. I do drop a couple of frames. I need some help. I don't know where the friendly team is, though. I don't know where the friendly team is, and I'm going to back away. Casually walk away. Like nobody's going to go ahead and pop out there just so we can get out. And here comes a big engagement. Going ahead, throw a stun. We do catch two members of the enemy team. Really good job there. Jumping here on Sylvanas. I am going to be able to pick up the stun. Doing a lot of damage here on Sylvie. We do pick up the kill. Now getting out of the way. Jumping the other way. Can I get a stun there on Illidan? Oh, we do miss it. I'm trying to slow him down. And we're taking so much damage. And we do go down. Meanwhile, that counter pushed on the top, though. 
that that pushed up though. Remember I was saying that he has the he has the hunt and he can join in at any second. He does the hunt. Oh my god, this game. Dude, I've been trying to record. I'm not even joking with you guys. This is like my third game in a row trying to record, and it's been like either bots or nonsense has just been upsetting. I think this this game has been sort of close. 44 kills to 33. We definitely had an edge in team fighting. But between the friendly Tiro who's a little bit lost in space and the friendly Illidan who does not care. He just does not care. <laughs> he does not want anything to do with it. Uh, it's basically been me, Sylvanas, and Lily versus the world with Tiro someone sometimes making a guest appearance. So uh, it's been really devastating. I hope we win it. I feel like we can win it. We're three keeps up. This is a really good opportunity. They might be going for the boss now. Uh, they are still really far behind on gems. So you gotta try to stay positive, try to win it here. But it's so frustrating sometimes when your friendly team uh, teammate decides not to uh, not to basically play. I don't know. Uh, I don't know what the purpose of this is. To be honest, again. Sorry for the salt, but this is more like an analysis. I don't understand why some players, because this game does not reward you even a little bit from being a solo unless you're doing a split push sort of mentality. Uh, and even then, it's it's really sort of team oriented. So I don't understand the the reasoning behind this. Um, I mean, is, is it for fun? Is it? I don't really know. I don't really know. Let me know in the comments down below if you actually understand why a player would opt to go super solo in this game. Since you're not really doing much, as you can see, uh, as far as kills goes, he is 25. We have 36 and 39 on Sylvanas. Um, so it would make sense that you want to stick up with the team and pick up weak targets, right? I don't know. Does look like he's finally hunting there on Sylvanas. Dude, a lot of damage. He does get silenced and then walks away at the last second. Even though he, called, he, could have, he could have dived. Divin? He could have dived? He could have dove? I don't even know. It's a regular verf. I'm so tired that my English is coming uh, difficult to me. We're going to go ahead and just auto attack this. Turn into chocolate just to make sure we can tank this to the phase. And just auto attack here for days. Here comes the boss. This is going to be enough to pick up the kill here. No problem. I'm actually going to jump on them. It comes to stun never mind that's a win we finally managed to pull it up thank you so much for watching it was uh, it was a ro an emotional roller coaster for me there you go 45 to 33 my name is al i hope you enjoyed the video and i will see you all next time that's the one